hey friends welcome to the youtube channel all about electronics so in this question we have been given a ring oscillator which is operating at the 1 gigahertz so here we have been given that when the biasing voltage of the ring oscillator is increased by the 0.5 volt then its oscillation frequency also increases by the 500 megahertz so in this ring oscillator we have been asked to find the propagation delay of the each inverter at the new biasing voltage so in the question we have been given that this ring oscillator is operating at the 1 gigahertz so in the earlier video of the ring oscillator we have seen that for the n stage ring oscillator its oscillation frequency can be given by this expression that is equal to 1 divided by 2n times tp where the n is the number of stages in the ring oscillator and this tp is the propagation delay of the each inverter so if we just rearrange this expression then we can write it as this tp is equal to 1 divided by 2n times f that means here this tp is equal to 1 divided by this 2 times this 5 times 1 gigahertz that is equal to 10 to the power 9 or we can say that that is equal to 1 divided by 10 to the power 10 so that is equal to 100 times 10 to the power minus 12 or we can say that the propagation delay of the each inverter is equal to 100 picosecond so this is the propagation delay of the each inverter when the ring oscillator is operating at the 1 gigahertz now here we have been given that in this ring oscillator the biasing voltage of the each inverter is increased by the 0.5 volt and with this increase in the biasing voltage the oscillation frequency will also increase by the 500 megahertz that means now if you see the new oscillation frequency then that is equal to 1.5 gigahertz so now at this new oscillation frequency let us find the propagation delay of the each inverter so once again the oscillation frequency of the ring oscillator can be given by this expression and if we rearrange this expression then this new propagation delay is equal to 1 divided by this 2n times new oscillation frequency that is equal to 1 divided by 2 times 5 times 1.5 gigahertz and that is equal to 1.5 times 10 to the power 9 so further we can write it as this 10 to the power minus 10 divided by 1.5 or we can say that that is equal to 100 picosecond divided by 1.5 that is equal to 66.6 picosecond so we can say that the new propagation delay of the inverter is equal to 66.6 picosecond and therefore for the given question the answer is equal to 66.6 picosecond